All eyes are on Afghanistan with just days until the deadline to withdraw our troops. The situation has become even more urgent after the deadly attack yesterday. Local veterans are watching with extra concern. Our Hannah Brandt spoke with one who's also one of our state's top officials. Hannah. Alicia, just hours ago, I sto spoke with State Treasurer Stacey Garrity, who served three tours in Iraq. She was in charge of overseeing a prison in the country, which gives her a unique perspective on what's happening now in Afghanistan. Of course, the situation in Afghanistan took a turn from dangerous to deadly this week, with 13 American service members and dozens of Afghan people killed in a terrorist attack. The treasurer tells me she's devastated for those troops killed and their families, and she's angry about what she calls a failure of leadership on the part of the president. Nobody expected us to stay in Afghanistan forever, but you don't just cut and run on a 20-year commitment. We shouldn't leave not one American behind, not even one. We shouldn't leave any of our Afghans that worked so hard mm -hmm. with our military behind. Now I also spoke with the treasurer about a number of other topics, including American rescue plan money being sent to local cities, unclaimed property, and her first eight months in office. You can catch our full interview this Sunday at 10 on This Week in Pennsylvania.